Let's display the real-time clock inside the game in Unreal Engine. First click on the content drawer, then right-click inside it. Go to User Interface, then Widget Blueprint, select User Widget and give it a name such as WBP underscore HUD for example. After that, open it. In the palette, search for Canvas Panel, then drag and drop the Canvas Panel into the workspace. Next, search for Text, drag and drop a text block and set the font to any size you like. For instance, I chose 35. Then check the is variable box to true and rename it to text block clock, for example. Once done, compile and save it. Next, go to the content section and click on create binding. Inside this function, we will use the now node, search for the now node, then break it into its daytime components to access details such as year, month, day, and hour. After that, add a format text node. In the format text node, use curly braces and labels to define variables like hour, minute, and second. Once you hit enter, you'll see input pins appear on the format text node where you can connect the broken datetime components to each variable, then connect the output to the return node, save your work, and open your character blueprint. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Locate the event begin play node. If it's not there, you can create it by overriding the event. Next, create a widget instance. For the widget class, select the W, B, P, H, U, D we just created and add it to the viewport. That's all you need to do to complete the setup. Now play the game and you'll see the real-time clock displayed on the top left corner of the screen. That's how you can integrate it into your project. Thank you for watching. If you found this helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to stay updated with more tutorials. Your support means a lot and I'll see you in the next video.